In this tutorial, I'll show you how to use collision sensor logic brakes to reduce a health property when the car hits an obstacle. Open the file made in the previous tutorial. You can make the file yourself or download it from my website. Change the layout to the default layout. Select the car and set its Y location to be minus 20. Zoom back with the mouse wheel. I'm going to add an obstacle. Add mesh cylinder. And I'm going to set its X location to be minus 1. I'm going to set its Y location to be minus 4. And its Z location to be 1. Change the layout back to game logic. Start the game. And now it's much harder to drive up the ramp. I want to add a health property to the game so that when the car collides with an obstacle its health goes down. Now I could add a collision sensor to the cylinder and that would work fine but I'm going to select the car in the outliner window and add the collision sensor to that and I'm going to add an AND controller and a message actuator. Scroll down, clicking the white triangle on the keyboard sensor closes that up. Now when the car collides with any object the collision sensor will send a signal which will travel through the AND controller and if I connect up the message actuator it will broadcast a message the subject of which will be BANG Drag with the middle mouse button to rotate the view. Behind the cylinder is an object of type empty, which I named game. If you click the plus at the side of the logic editor window, it opens up the properties panel. I've already added a score property to the empty. Now I'm going to add a health property. Click the add game property button. Name the new property health. Change its type to integer. Set its initial value to 10. And if you click the information button, the health will be displayed in the debug area when we test the game. I'm going to use the view menu to close the properties panel. I'm going to scroll up and I'm going to use the white triangles to close up the logic bricks. I'm going to add a message sensor, an AND controller and a property actuator. When the message sensor senses a message whose subject is bang, when the car collides with something, it will send a signal which will travel through the AND controller to the property actuator where we will add minus 1 to the property health. Now if I start the game, remember to change the view to the camera view first and start the game. And if I drive forward and hit this cylinder, my health goes down. If I press escape and select the cylinder and move it out of the way and start the game. Now, if I accelerate hard or brake hard, I make contact with the ground and my health goes down. When I hit the ramp, my health goes down. When I collect the gems, my health goes down. How can we set up the game so the health only goes down when the car collides with an obstacle? If I select the car in the outliner window, scroll down and look at the collision sensor, there is this button here, toggle collision on material or property. If I click the button, there is a field to select a material and the collision sensor will only send a signal if the car collides with an object that has the selected material. If I click the button again, it changes to a property field, I can specify a property and the sensor will only send a signal if the car collides with an object with the specified property. To test both methods, change the layout to the default layout, select the cylinder, click the material button, click the add new material button and call the new material obstacle. Add mesh cube Click the object properties, set the X location to be 2, the Y location to be minus 4, and the Z location to be 1. Go back to game logic layout. 
With the cube selected, click the plus, click the add game property button and call the new property collide. Select the car in the outliner window, close the properties panel, scroll down and in the property field type collide. The collision sensor will now only send a signal when the car collides with an object that has the property collide. So if I start the game, the only object in the scene that has the property collide is the cube. So when I hit that, the health goes down. But when I hit the cylinder, the health is unaffected. To make the cylinder affect the health, we could add the property collide to it, or we can add another collision sensor and if we click the toggle button and select the material obstacle and if we change the AND controller to an ALL controller and connect that up now the message bang will be broadcast if the car collides with an object that has the property collide or the car collides with an object that has the material obstacle we could add more collision sensors for other materials and connect those to the OR controller, whichever method suits your game. I'm going to end the tutorial there. I'll put the start file and the end file at my website www.freemovies.co.uk at the Blender channel there. Thanks for watching and goodbye.